Greetings, pod fans. So it's been, like, over a week now. I think it's time for me to talk about it. I was at Brocon! 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 And I was there for two reasons. One, I really wanted to go. I like the convention scene. Uh, I like the people involved. Uh, I only knew one of them, really, on, when I was going there. And he's a cool guy, and he does Let's Play things. I'll talk about that in a little while. But yeah, I went there because it was going to be fun. And two, I went there because I'm involved in a convention. Remember Kaizoku Khan? I'm the public relations officer. I publicly relate. I'm not very good at the public, though. But we'll get back to that. Let's go back to talking about Brocon. It was pretty cool. On the Saturday of the thing, I just walked into the trader hall and I was like looking around and I saw Subcity Games, who were really cool, like comic bookshop in Galway and I went straight up there and I checked if they had a thing turned out they had the thing and I bought it on the spot <laughs> uh, this is a uh, mathematical edition volume 3 uh, of the Adventure Time comics I now have 1, 2 and 3 and they're really good and I love hardback books look at that Princess Bubblegum and it's really 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 cool um, but yeah that was awesome another thing that I bought there was this also from Subcity Games, actually. <laughs> uh, so, that's Vader. Can you guess what it is? William Shakespeare's Star Wars. It's basically, you know, A New Hope, which was originally called Star Wars, um, written in the style of a uh, Shakespeare play. As in, like, perfectly. It's really well done. Sure, like, it's very, like, you know, Herd, 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 this is Shakespeare, let's make this Shakespeareanized, but it's really funny as well. Like, there's a point where R2-D2 is being like, beep, boop, beep, boop, 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 and 3PO is all like, Oh, thou thost wilt be the death of me, and stuff, and it's exit C-3PO. And then R2-D2 goes off in a soliloquy in English. He's just talking to him, and it's, uh, I'll read you like the first line of that, because it's really funny. In my mind, anyway. Um, <laughs> this golden droid has been a friend, tis true, and yet I wish to still his prating tongue. An imp he call, <laughs> an imp he calleth me. I'll be revenged, and merry pranks a plenty I shall play upon this pompous droid C three PO. Yet not in language shall my pranks be done. Around both humans and droids, I must be seen to make such errant beeps and squeaks that they s shall think me simple. Truly, though, although it sounds oblique I speak to them, I clearly see how I shall play my part, and how a vast rebellion shall succeed by wit and wisdom of a simple droid. Ah, perfect! Ah, it's brilliant! I, I don't even know how to... Ah, it's great. It just implies that he's only doing this to make himself seem more simple. It's... Ah! So I was very excited about that. Then, if any of you play Magic the Gathering, I bought an M15 fat pack, and I pulled a Nissa. If you don't play Magic the Gathering, Nissa is the money card in this set. It, like, is worth the most money, and it's really freaking good at doing the things. So yeah, that's pretty much all of the um, things that I got it broke on. I would show you my, like, cards, but they've been filed away. Yes, I put them in order of colour and rarity and rah, you don't care. Um, what else is there to talk about? Oh, I guess we better get to the Kaizoku Khan thing. So on the final day, the Sunday, there was a closing ceremony and they were letting Khan people go up and give announcements and blah 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 and we were all like, yeah, well let's do that. So myself and the Khan director, Alan, who's really cool, we went up and Alan was going first and he was like, hey, I had everyone have fun, it broke on, blah blah blah, and he was doing great. And then it came to me and I was like, this is the mic by the way, this is my mouth. And I was talking and someone in the crowd tried to indicate, meh, meh, and I was like, I don't know what you're saying, okay, um, whoops. And yes, uh, then I kind of forgot how to speak. Because we were announcing dates and I announced the dates and it was grand. I did it with the mic miles away from my mouth. And then I was trying to say, we've got a guest lined up, and we're working on that, and we're not going to announce it today, and it'll be in a while. But my mouth just kind of went, I'm... Oh, uh, sorry, I'm not very good at words. And then I said it. But I was just like, I hate 
everything I... You know, a couple of times I've mentioned I'm not good in public. That was one of the times I'm not good in public. <laughs> However, after that, um, two people that I know from Kaisuku Khan last year came up to me and said, PodCon is best con, and I was like, thank you. Uh, but I was still in like super awkward mode, so it was probably like, thank you. <laughs> you know, I am a robot sent from the future to be awkward around humans. Uh, that is my life. Uh, but yes, it was a very fun weekend. The end kind of made me go, Mah, I hate everything. But I got over it. Now I'm able to talk about it and feel, yes. I don't know, I like trying to look cool in public and not be this ball of, Mah. Don't know what that was. But yes, uh, onto the guy who I talked about who does Let's Plays. He goes by Convara LP, which you probably won't be able to get. It's a Irish thing. Yep. Yeah. But there'll be a link in the info box. Um, I encourage you to watch their, like, uh, the most recent thing. It was like nine months ago, but he said that, you know, now that I've been all like, do more, he's gonna do more. But yeah. Um, one thing from that video, still, it's really funny. I just watched the entire thing. It made me laugh quite a bit. I would, yes, please do that, please. I'd like that. He's a good friend of mine. Uh, we've been friends on Facebook for quite a while, and it was like a year or two after we were friends on Facebook. We were introduced to each other. The world is a weird place these days, but yeah. Uh, check that out. There'll be a link in the info box. He's cool. He does cool things. It's all let's play thingies and yes um, Do I have anything else to talk about? Probably not. So I'm going to go and yes I will try to make videos more re more uh, proactively or whatever, but I'm not promising anything because I'm bad at promises and life and everything and words and where I have to get a haircut. Talk to you soon Sloan